man. Oh, I thought, what is happening? I thought today was a day that we were going to be able to sleep in, dogs. Oh, look who's here. Hi, everybody. It's Eric, and we aren't going to school today. In fact, we might just be able to stay in our pajamas the entire day. And one of the best things about being able to be in our pajamas all day and not being at school is we can do all the exploring that we want. And so today, we are going to have our very first episode of Science in Your Pajamas. And I was spinning and 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 spinning. Eventually, I woke up. And when I woke up, I found myself trying to hide in the grass and the leaves of the forest. One of the reasons I was so good at hiding was my shirt and my shorts are the same color as the leaves and the grass of the bottom of the forest. By mimicking or having my clothing match the colors of the ground, I was able to hide. When the color of a living thing matches the color of its environment, scientists say that living thing is mimicking its environment. We might call that type of mimicry camouflage. And as I was so proud of my colors matching the color of the leaves and the grass, I started to wonder, are there other kinds of animals whose colors match the color of their surroundings so they could be good hunters or so they don't become prey? I wonder what kind of animals live near our home and I wonder what kind of animals live all over the world and how do they hide using mimicry. Dun dun dun! Find the hidden animals! Okay friends, now it's your turn. You have 10 seconds to find each animal. On your mark, get set, go! <laughs> Find the hidden animals. You have 10 seconds. Find as many as you can before your time runs out. 